What is going on guys, Zara here and welcome to today's video and before we even start the video, obviously you can see by the title we're talking about something pretty big and I want to say a little disclaimer at the beginning of this video that any sort of, you know, conclusions we're going to come to aren't really completely conclusive. They're not going to be 100% fact, we're just going off evidence we've got and evidence that's come to me today and so we're just drawing, you know, what we can from this and I might be completely wrong, I hope I'm sort of proved wrong really to be honest by the information I've got today but just a disclaimer so you know before you think about judging the video in terms of what I'm about to tell you guys in this video just remember that I'm just going off what's been given to me what we found out from the information so let's get into it so as you can see by the title the title of today's video is F1 2015 delayed till July or even later um so so now you may be wondering, how on earth have I, you know, just thought, oh, this is going to happen? How have I plucked this out of thin air that this is going to be a thing? So basically this afternoon, just chilling out on Twitter, um, and then I get a tweet from one of you guys, I'm guessing, a viewer, a subscriber, um, German nationality. Um, he links me to a German forum and tells me about some things that are going on in this forum that have been said. And uh, I'll link him in the description, his Twitter handle. So thank you very much for the information if you're watching. Uh, his name's Thatch on Twitter. Um, so basically what happened was he tweeted me with some information saying a German journalist wrote in this forum and this forum by the way is part of like a website which is like a I'm gonna guess quite a big website for German Formula 1 fans for the game it's called f1game.de so I'm guessing it's quite big um, you know the forums are quite hefty they've got quite a lot of forum posts even bigger than the Codemasters forums themselves so essentially Thatch uh, told me that a German journalist had said the preview event in Germany, a preview event in Germany, uh, which should have been on Wednesday, this this Wednesday coming this week, has been moved to June 9th, which obviously is three days before the supposed release date, June 12th. So obviously one straight away, you know, at first I thought, okay, this, this has to be a bit weird because moving to June 9th, that means three days before the release and that's just not possible. So I asked further uh, uh, what was going on. He said, yeah, yeah, it, it is being moved and he linked me to the forum post. So I thought I'd read up on the forum post. Obviously, it was all in German, but I, I translated it uh, with Google Translate. So I've got some screenshots right now. So the first screenshot you can see here is a forum post by someone called Robbie, and he's the administrator of this entire forum. And it seems he's the kind of journalist or the one kind of connected with Codemasters in terms of he's probably on their list for publisher for like journalist publishers and whatnot. So I'm, he runs this forum as well, I'm guessing. So he says that um, next week you know more. Maybe I meet Codemasters again. So obviously this is talking about they obviously had a first preview event a lot of journalists from across the world had this preview event for Codemasters because we obviously got that announcement and then we had that flood of news um you know like four weeks back with a with the first preview cop with the first preview event going on where they uh, went around Singapore in the wet so this is he's saying again that he's going to meet with Codemasters so this is on top of the one they already had and so that's the first screenshot. And then we go to the actual one, which uh, um, this person's linked me on Twitter, is this very one, where it says preview event on May 22nd. So May 22nd, uh, it's actually not Wednesday, it's actually Friday indeed. So Friday, May 22nd, has been cancelled. And he puts in brackets problems with the preview version and then a little face palm emoticon. Um, so I don't know how reliable this is. Um, this Robbie person is an administrator of this site. It seems like he's also, you know, very much part of the press of this site. I think this this site is a much more than just a forum. They're a proper journalism site for German Formula One fans. And I think he checks out because with that also, previously in the forum, like if we go back on the forum, there's this picture. And this is a picture he posted, Robbie, this person, the administrator, posted a picture of him with a early copy of... Of F1 2015, a 20 F1 2015 pre-build copy, promotional disc, not for resale, and he's put his own um, little, you know, what do you call it, watermark on it. So, and this picture is really high res. I had to make an account on this site to actually access this picture high res, so I could actually check it out, and it it looks pretty damn legit. I mean, I can't. If it is fake, then it's probably one of the best fakes I've seen because I can't see anything. It looks like the proper thing, you know, the Xbox cover. You've got a promotional disc, no kind of cover or anything, obviously, because it's a promotional thing. And this is one. This is from a pre previous promotional event 
or promotion a promotional preview uh, because it's a very very early copy it says on the forum so so to me that means that this guy checks out that this source is quite legitimate in terms of they do they have worked with codemasters before they have dealt with getting press copies before with codemasters so it checks out that when he says the event was delayed from 22nd of may which is friday um it's been moved to june apparently new date june 9th which is three days before the release of f1 2015 so obviously before we even move on to the next screenshot i can already tell you that if that is true then there's no way this game's coming out on june 12th because by then well you know if if the game was to come out on june 12th basically i would say honestly myself and a lot of other f1 youtubers the bigger ones will probably be hoping that we already have review copies with us um you know early review copies to release gameplay to you guys early you know a few days before the release date you know last year for f1 2014 some of us got preview copies two weeks in advance of the game and then we got a review copy and the review copy is essentially the same thing you guys can buy but it just says review on it and it it, it just kind of watermarked with review but it's still the exact same retail copy essentially but on steam and we get that we got that for f1 2014 you know a week or so before the release date now if a pre if a preview event is on june 9th three days before the release there is if it's completely true if it is true there's no way this game's coming out on june 12th because it doesn't make sense to have a preview event with a preview code or a preview thing because all the reviews would have to come out all the reviewers would get their codes a week before june 12th to start writing their reviews you know not only just youtubers ign gamespot everyone would have to get their review codes a week earlier to actually play the game and review it and write up their article ready to click, you know, go, go, go on the Wednesday, two days before the release. So if this information is true, and to be honest, personally, you know, I was a bit skeptical when, um, you know, this follower, you know, tweeted me about it, but... You know, looking further into it, looking at the picture he posted about the Xbox thing, and just looking at how big the site is itself. So it's obvious that this person is affiliated with, you know, this whatever this press journalism thing is in Germany, you know, this F1 game.de, and they have done stuff with Codemasters in the past. So I, I think this checks out, and this could be quite big that this game might be delayed and uh later on in the forum i'm not too sure who this person is exactly it says presenter so i'm not too sure if he works with this site or he's just a another forum poster but it basically says the same thing as i've just said that basically you know why would they have a preview three games before three days before the game releases it doesn't make sense so that means the shift for the game to come out has to commence and that they'll have to push it back so the release date might be pushed back, and it could be pushed back to July, you know, maybe more. I'm not too sure, but July seems like maybe a kind of logical thing, just a month back. Project Cars has had two, three delays. I think two major two major delays where it was getting so close to the release date, and then they pushed it back a month, and then they pushed it back a month. And so, yeah, I think this is... A little bit saddening. I really hope it's not true. For your sake, for my sake, I really hope it is not true. But, um, you know, I've, you know, I looked into it. You know, I was very skeptical when I first got the tweet from Thatch and he linked me all the stuff and I started Google translating it. And, you know, I checked back on the forums. I checked all the way back to like April to see if, like, you know, they had done stuff with Codemos in the past, then got linked this picture. And then lo I made an account to log in to view the picture in high rays. And it all seems to check out really. And it all sways to there is some sort of German preview event, maybe. And it's been delayed till June 9th. And if it's delayed to June 9th, then that doesn't make sense. Unless the preview event is being turned into a review event three days before the game comes out. Then, you know, then it could maybe still come out June 12th. But it's a preview event. I don't know how that changes to a review event being delayed. You know, I don't see how a preview event in the calendar is delayed and then just turns into a review event. Like, oh, no, we won't show you preview code. We'll just delay it a month and show you the full review game three days in advance. That's hardly enough time for these German journalists to, you know, make a video, record it, you know, write up a good article and then switch it around in literally less than 24 hours, three days before the game is going to be out. So, yeah. But as I said, all of this, you know, I've drawn some sort of conclusion here, but it is very unconclusive in terms of, 
you know, it could very much all just be a very, you know, kind of wishy-washy sort of thing. But, you know, this is the information I've been given. And to me, it seems to check out quite well. And we've had stuff in the, this in the past with Codemasters that things have leaked out. Journalists have been told stuff. You know, there's been other random websites that have been, you know, you know, leaking information. Last year for 2014, we had a Japanese site have a really early copy of the game. And they'd leaked screenshots and stuff. And this year, it seems to be a German journalist who's dropped this bombshell of the game game being delayed and this post was only made today i think uh the one about it being delayed um f from friday to june 9th i think the post was made today the day i'm making this video so very fresh news um yeah i'm a little disappointed i really hope it's not true but it could very much be and if it is it's uh, it's a big deal because, you know, we haven't even heard any news since the preview event from four weeks ago. No trailers, which you would think one month ago, less than one month ago, you would think we'd get trailers, you would think we'd get gameplay. Nothing. I, As far as I'm aware, none of us YouTubers have been told anything. I certainly haven't. Not sure about any other people, but definitely we haven't been told anything. So it's com everyone's completely in the dark, to be honest, apart from the journalists who have been invited to a preview event in Germany. Um, and that's been delayed. So, yeah, that has been the video for today. If you did, you know, find the video informative, and I guess if it turns out to be true, then I guess it will be quite informative. Then do give the video a like. Comment below on what you thought. Do you think this is legit? Do you think it checks out? Um, you can. I, I'll link this, the German site in the description. So if any of you guys are German who watch me, then you can go click on the site. You can maybe tell me if it might check out, if it's going to be legit maybe. Um, so yeah, if you're new around here, then do subscribe for more F1 2015 news as it comes. Um, yeah, unfortunately, maybe not a lot of news will be coming in the next like few weeks, but hopefully... Uh, fingers crossed, I'm fing uh, crossing my fingers right now that this is completely wrong and that maybe it does come out in June 12th, but from what I'm seeing right now, it looks like hev he heavy possibility it might be delayed, so, yeah. I don't know, guys, I don't know. But yeah, I've been over, hope you enjoy the rest of the day, and I'll see you guys next time.